Well, they are the number one high school debate team in the country, and they're from right here in the five boroughs. Richard Giacobis introduces us to the skilled squad from Bronx Science and has more on their secrets to dominance. If keeping them in place is hurting Venezuelan individuals, we shouldn't keep them in place. And the motto for the more than 400 speech and debate students at Bronx High School Science is practice makes perfect. For those and they've certainly proven perfection. We always say we're like a team, not a club, but above all, we're a family. Both the novice and varsity debate teams here at Bronx Science are currently ranked number one in the country. No tryouts, no cuts. You just have to show up. We research together, we share articles, we do practice rounds, we do drills to help each other like speak better. The talent here is quite impressive as soon as these mostly high school juniors and seniors begin their back and forth. They each perform a different style of debate, from congressional, which is a group style debate, to Lincoln Douglas, a one on one type of debate. The uh, speakers and debaters on our team, they really put forth uh, really maximum effort to, to do the best that they can. Right, but also you can Three of the speech and debate captains say their secret to success is pretty simple. Tap into your own style, be it aggressive or emotional. There's even a trick involving the word watermelon. Someone could read down a textbook as fast as they can, saying the word watermelon in between, which trains people to differentiate each word. A group of some pretty smart debaters who are striving to keep winning by taking home these trophies year after year, debate after debate. The more than 400 both novice and varsity speech and debate teams here at Bronx High School Science are trying to hold on to this number one title from last school year. They're going to keep going until June of 2022 when they compete in the national tournament on the big stage. They hope to keep that title and bring it back home. We're here in the Bedford Park section of the Bronx. Richard Giacobas, Fox 5 News.